Because of the February freeze, a lot of Texas trees were impacted like this. Betsy Morton emailed the Verify team with this question. If I want to remove a tree on my property, do I need a permit? With Verify, we make sure to tell you our sources first. We spoke with Courtney Blevins, regional urban forester for the Texas A&M Forest Service, and Naomi Rotramel, arborist for the city of Austin. Tree removal laws vary not only city to city, but, but state, state, to state to state. So we're focusing on Texas. There are no state laws that prohibit someone from removing a tree on their property. Whoever has the tree, the trunk of the tree, growing in their yard, they are the owner of the tree. If part of someone else's tree is hanging over or spreading to your property, you can trim it as long as you don't kill the tree. If that happens, you could potentially be held liable. The property owner has the right to trim over their airspace, and that's held up in courts uh, through the ages. So we can verify. Yes, based on state laws, you can remove a tree on your property or part of someone else's tree that has grown onto your property as long as no permanent damage takes place. There are some local ordinances in different parts of Texas that may keep you from removing certain trees or require you to get a permit. Best way to find out what yours might be is to contact your city's Parks and Recreation Department. And if you have anything you'd like us to verify, send an email to verify at WFAA.com.